ukijua wewe ndiye uweza wetu bwana hata jioni ya leo ni yote ambayo yamekuwa kama mzigo wetu bwana tunaachilia kwako jioni ya leo yale yamekuwa kama vikwazo tunaachilia kwako jioni ya leo yale yamekuwa kama weakness kwetu tunaachilia kwako jioni ya leo ukatushukie kwa nguvu zako e bwana ukatutangaze kwa damu yako e bwana ukatuoshe kwa damu ya amani jioni ya leo ukatupatie kiba
kuna vitu ambavyo vinaingizwa hata zimeletwa hata kanisani zimeletwa hata kwa watu wa Mungu zimeletwa hata kwa waimbaji zimeletwa hata kwa kwa baji ili kuweza kuwadanganya ili tukaweza kuiba wimbo wao lakini ni wakati wa kusimama imara ili tukaweza kumwambia Bwana wimbo wa Bwana neno la Bwana linastahili pahali ambapo uh, pametego kwa ajili ya jambo hilo bila kuchanganyikana bila kuchanganywa katika jina la Yesu karibuni sana na tukaweza kumulilia Mungu wakati uh, huu ambao ametupa ili tukaweza kuomba na kuinua sauti zetu tukiwa tunaokotwa na kiongozi karibu brother haya tukaweza kumuomba Hallelujah. Oh, the Lord is here. It is his promise. Katika neno lake anasema where two or three are gathered. He verse inaweza kukaa very simple. You might look at it very simply but it is a very powerful verse. Hallelujah. Anasema where two or three are gathered. It is a promise. And the Bible says each and every promise that has been written in the word of God is fulfilled in Christ Jesus. Hallelujah. Say my amen. Every promise is fulfilled. The Bible says all promises are yes and amen in Christ Jesus. It was a promise that when two or three are gathered, he will be there. So he is here with us. Hallelujah. Tutakuwa na prayer items tano. Ya kwanza, tutaenda kwa umbea kanisa. Nasimanishu wa tumishi. Kanisa as in the body of Christ. Tunenda kwa umbea wale ambao wameoshwa kwa dami ya Yesu. Hallelujah. Kwa sababu, kuna mambo ambayo tunapitia. Kuna misukosuko ambayo kanisa inapitia as the body of Christ. We need to pray for ourselves and we need to pray for this God. Hallelujah. We are praying, but the Lord had already prayed for us. Hallelujah. I want us to remind ourselves of that situation when Jesus was about to be crucified. Alienda na wale wanafunzi wake. Akasimama na akasema anaomba kwa baba yake. Akasema na waumbea hao. Kumi na wawi. Akaendelea kuwaombea alafu akataja mahali akasema na si hawa peke yake na waombea na wale ambao watakuja kuamini kwa ajili ya neno la watakalo kupii hallelujah we were included in that prayer and then Jesus said i am not praying for the world hallelujah why was he not praying for the world because he was going to shed his blood for them hallelujah Bwana asifiwe. He was going to shed his blood for the world. But for those who are his, he prayed for them. Bwana asifiwe. So Jesus is interceding for us. We are already in that group that he mentioned when he was praying before his father. That I'm praying for them who shall come to believe through this, the 12 disciples. And we are here today. Hallelujah. Are we here? Hallelujah. Tuliombewa na Yesu. Haleluya. Na sasa leo tunalo jumungu la kuwaombea wale ambao hawajafikiliwa na habari hizi jema za uko. Wana Yesu wa sifiwi. Amen. We are going to read from the book of 2nd Corinthians. 2nd Corinthians chapter 4. I will read from verse 7. Inasema, but we have the treasure in earthen vessels. He's talking here about the Holy Spirit to show that the transcendent power belongs to God and not to us. Praise the Lord. Amen. We are afflicted in every way. He's talking about the church, not the world. Hallelujah. But not crushed. We are perplexed, but not driven to despair. We are persecuted, but not forsaken. Hallelujah. We are struck down, but not destroyed. Hallelujah. Always carrying in the body the death of Jesus. And then we go again to the same book, 2 Corinthians chapter 1. I want us to see 
why we are persecuted, why we, we are this, we, we are we, we are we are stricken down. Uh, the Bible says all this happens so that we can be able to comfort one as if you. So we are here to pray, to make a prayer of comfort for the ones who have been called.
the church is winning the battle in the name of Jesus. Holy Father, I want to thank you. You said upon this rock, I bid my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail. Father, we thank you because we are conquerors through Christ Jesus. I want to magnify you, Lord, and exalt you. You are faithful, Jehovah God. You are worthy, King of glory. You are what saints and God of all grace who has called us unto his eternal glory. After having suffered a while, may establish, strengthen, and settle us. Father, again, I will say that the last glory of this house shall be greater than the former. God of my life, I want to thank you. You say in your word of God, upon Mount Zion, there shall be deliverance and holiness, and the people of God shall possess. We want to thank you, Lord. We thank you, Holy Spirit. We thank you, our Lord. You prayed, oh Jesus. You prayed for the church. You said, I am praying for them that you may keep them from evil. Father, Lord Jesus, everyone who confesses Jesus, Lord, you are keeping them, Lord. You are protecting them, Lord, from every harm, Lord, from any evil king of glory. You are covering them with the precious blood of Jesus. I want to thank you, Father, even at this time, Jehovah God. You say, and we know that in all things, God works together for good to them that love God, to them that are called according to his purpose. For he also did predestinate to be conformed to the image of his son, that he might be the firstborn among many brethren, and whom he predestinated, them he also called, and whom he called, them he also justified, and whom he justified, them he also glorified. What shall we then say about these things? If God be for us, who shall Yeah. 
Because you are God, you pray for the church. You say that there may be one, even as you are one with the Father. Lord, I pray for unity in the body of Christ. I pray for oneness, Lord, that our yes be yes, and our no be no King of glory. In the name of Jesus, that my Father, as your word says, till we all come in the unity of faith and in the knowledge of the Son of God, and to a perfect man, and to the measure of the stature of the fullness of Christ, that we have for be no more children, tossed to and fro, and carried about by every wind of doctrine, and on the slate of man, and by cunning toughness, whereby they lie in way to deceive, but we, speaking the truth in love, may grow up into him who is the head, even Christ, from whom the whole body fitly joined together and compacted by that which every joint supplies, according to the effectual working in the power of the Holy Spirit. Mm-hmm. Father, we magnify you. Father, we exalt you. Mm-hmm. You are God, Jehovah. You are holy king of glory. Mm-hmm. Thank you for the church. Thank you, Thank you for this church. Thank you. Thank you for this church. Thank you, Thank you for this church. Lord, I pray for oneness. Lord, I pray for unity. Oh, yes. Lord, I pray for our leaders. Lord, that you may bless them, Lord. I pray for our pastors, Lord, that you may bless them, Lord, that you may use them, Lord. You have called them in this church, Lord, at a time like this, King of Glory. May you strengthen them, Lord. May you use them as your vessel, King of Glory. Bless their life, Jehovah, Father. Fill them with your spirit, Lord. Guide them, King of Glory. Grant them your wisdom, Jehovah, Master. Jesus Christ, may you bless all our ladies, Lord. May you bless their families, Lord. May you bless them, Jehovah, Father. May you bless the elders of the church, King of Glory. May you bless Jesus and the congregation of the St. Paul Church, King of Glory. Bless your people, oh my Father, wherever they are, King of Glory. May you, Father, strengthen them, Lord, wherever they are, King of Glory. May you protect them, Jehovah, Father, wherever they are, King of Glory. May you heal them, Jehovah. Evangelize your word, O Lord. We know that God, it shall be well. It shall be well with the church, King of Glory. The church will carry out that mandate. The church will carry out that great mission of spreading the good news of Jesus Christ. We thank you, Father, because you are strengthening us, Lord. You are strengthening us, O King of Glory. We magnify you, Lord, and we exalt you. You are faithful, you are worthy, you are holy, there is none like you, Jesus. Be glorified and be magnified. In the name of Jesus, we pray and amen. 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 Amen.
mlango wa kuni soma kwa mstari wa kwanza inasema i hold myself and treat you by the meekness and gentleness of Christ i hope i am humble when i when face to face with you but bold to you when i am away i beg you i beg you that when i'm present i may not have to show boldness in such confidence as i count on showing against some who suspect us of acting in what we fashion for though we live in the world people mistake us at times because we live in the world they think we are fighting the battle with our flesh hallelujah Paul says, for the weapons of our warfare are not worthy, but have divine power to destroy strongholds. We destroy arguments and every proud obstacle to the knowledge of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Our next prayer item, those who are watching us in our social media, we are about to pray for our children. We want to pray for your children. We want to pray for those Satan is taking advantage of because they lack knowledge. They are so young, they don't know the word of God. So if we don't cover them with the prayers of the righteous people, they'll be vulnerable. What a severe son. Let us pray for the children. We see how they are walking carelessly. We see how Satan is taking advantage of them, wherever they are. For Matatu, so let us go before the Lord and pray for the children. Let us remember them. Satan has no power. Hallelujah. He has no power over our children. And I speak with confidence because God chose a vessel like us. But it pleased him to put his spirit in us so that we can speak and he endorses. Hallelujah. We are praying for our children. We are praying for our children. We are praying for our children.
zaidi kuinuliwa hakika ukae mahali pasipo kwa jiko alipoinuka hakika ni wewe peke yako uliyotegemea leo na msaada wetu wa karibu kwa sababu hakuna mwingine tunayeweza kumtegemea bwana hakika hakuna mwingine tunayeweza kumuinua chini ya leo ndipo sasa Yesu tuko mahali hapa ni kwa ajili yako bwana ndipo tunasema ya kwamba unastahili Jehovah tumesema ya kwamba tukuite na utaitika tunasema Jehovah unastahili Jehovah kwa kiasi kwa kwa kumana Jehovah unaweza asante kwa sababu ya sana majira haya bwana asante ni kwa chini ya mwaka huu kwa rehema yote yaliyo kwa Mungu unasema unayajua ipo sasa sema ya sorry baba unayafahamu lakini yaliyo ya wazi ndio ya kwetu baba yako kwa sababu ulichuma yale yote yatakaopitia watoto wetu jinsi watakapokuwa bwana ulichuma ya kwamba hawataweza kusoma kwa baba huu Jehovah ulichuma ya kwamba hakitoa na mbrana huko na kule Jehovah lakini ni vyema Jehovah mechiwa serehi na tunaiteja mikono ni mwako Jehova ila baba kapata kuangalia ewe ndio mlinzi tunayokutegemea ewe ndio bwana ule wa karibu ewe ndio mwalimu ule wa karibu baba tunaomba kwa ajili ya uwezo na nguvu za roho mtakatifu ukaweze kuangalia kwa ajili ya watoto wetu tazama makundi wanaotembea nao bwana ni makundi yasiyostahili saba yangu basi kuomba baba ukaingie kati nenda ukatawalishe Jehova makundi mabaya na ingia kati yao katika jina la Yesu Kristo nenda baba ukapata ya kwamba wewe ni Mungu bwana sasa majinsi zile watu wako walikuwa watu wamekuwa Jehova kwa kuingiana na hali ya utaji wa madrasa na hii wamekuwa baba wa kulewa wewe wamekuwa baba wa hongo hongo hawajieleli ewe shetani sio ya leo tunachukua mamlaka na nguvu tutakembea kila hela zote ambazo baba umependa kupoteza watoto wetu katika jina la Yesu Kristo tupe mtamboa hata unaposemwa singe kanisani wakati huu Yesu Kwa jina la 
mwana kwa budu nasema ni asante kwa ajili ya vijana yule nasema asante kwa ajili ya vijana yule baba mahali alipotekwa nyara katika grupu ile baba naenda kumfungua jioni ya leo katika jina la Yesu Kristo nasema msema yule mahali pale alipofungiwa baba naenda kumfungua jioni ya leo katika jina la Yesu Kristo nenda baba kaweke huru kaweke huru Jehova na wakaweke kweli kweli jina lako ni lile jina lako litukuzwe niseme ni Jehova baba nilitukuza na kulirwa jina lako pokea sifa pokea utukufu bwana maana hakuna kama wewe bwana ndipo tunakuimbia Jehova hakuna mwingine hakuna kaka mtimilia hewe ndio baba yetu hewe ndio msaada wetu hewe ndio mama wetu hewe ndio tumaini letu bwana tunakuja kwako Jehova James tulipo nenda baba katuone huruma bwana ngomea huruma watoto wetu bwana ngomea huruma watoto wetu bwana na jaga hili tupate kuisha na tukai nua tena na kusema tumekuona Jehova asante bwana asante Kristo pokea sifa pokea utukufu maana yote baba na mama kwa imani na je hapa mnaenda kutenda ni katika jina la Yesu Kristo aliye bwana na mungu wetu
katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Umwema na fadhili za Allah ni zangu. Tunakushukuru Bwana kwa sababu ya vile umetupenda sisi wanadamu. Mungu wetu umetoa msha vyema. Tuko wazima hata saa hizi. Baba umetupa nguvu kule kwa neema yako. Nguvu za Roho Mtakatifu zinanena ndani yetu. Baba ukatupatia amri ya kukanyanga nyoka na nge na nguvu zote za ile Mungu. Jehova tunakupenda. Na ndio maana tuko mahali hapa. Hatuwezi kosa kukwambia ni asante kwa maombi yote yaliyopita. Na mimi nimesimama mbele yako jioni njema. Mimi mwanadamu Adam na nyama. Huenda nimetenda moja ama mbili. Nisilo kufurahisha. Baba unasema maombi ya mwenye dhambi ni makelele masikioni mwako. Na mimi nimetubu. Nikiwaleta watoto wa mwanamke waliopotea. Baba ili wiki ya wanawake ili wiki ya kukumbuka wa mama ili wiki ya kukumbuka uzao mwanamke baba ulivyotupenda ukatubariki na watoto ukatubariki na dada na ndugu ukatubariki na jamii ibrisi ya kai baba ameacha nyara na katika yote wengine
kumbuke kwa kumbuke baba jinsi maandiko yanavyosema katika kitabu cha Ufunuo wa 12 mwanamke amevishwa taji ya nyota 12 lakini utawaache nyoka nikiwafunika wote na damu ya Yesu Kristo kila mahali walipo wacha jina lako likatukuzwe na kuimuri wangu katika jina la baba na la mwana na roho mtakatifu tunaomba na kuamini
Nani kama yawe mtiziwa wa shuri 